The world is not going to be proud of you, Richard Spencer, told the student hecklers who interrupted nearly all 90 minutes of his talk at the University of Florida, on Thursday afternoon. Spencer said he came to the Gainesville campus to stir a debate, but there should be no debate about how the school handled his presence. Florida rose to the occasion. A little more than two months after he and other tiki torch wielding white nationalists terrorized the small band of counter-protesters at the University of Virginia and one rammed his car into a peaceful crowd, killing a woman and wounding several other people in Charlottesville, the country's most notorious white nationalist traveled to the campus of Florida's flagship university to lead an outright confab. The state's Republican governor, Rick Scott, declared a state of emergency in Alachua County, where the university is located, in order to free up more than $500,000 spent to secure the campus with more than 1,000 police officers in advance of Spencer's visit. Before his arrival, the campus Habad House, a Jewish organization, was targeted by the neo-Nazi publication The Daily Stormer. Although the public university and law enforcement have an obligation to maintain safety on campus and preserve law and order outside the venue, the state of Florida had no obligation to help organize the private event. Complaining that the university failed to stop disruptive student protesters, Spencer abruptly ended his talk early. You think that you shut me down well, UDIDNT. You actually even failed at your own game, he told students as he stormed off stage.